spotlight. So what does Governor Glenn Youngkin think can be done to address this? News 3 reporter Brendan Ponton talked with him today. Gun violence continues to be an issue all across Hampton Roads, and Governor Youngkin says there are things in the proposed state budget that would help. Youngkin took office in January as several Hampton Roads communities reported spikes in crime in 2021. And since then, the shootings have continued. Downtown Norfolk has been under the microscope following the shooting on Granby Street downtown and at MacArthur Center this past weekend. And today, Governor Youngkin visited Norfolk to talk with women business owners, and afterwards, we talked with him about what's going on here. It's heartbreaking. Uh, and I, uh, first of all, um, every morning find myself uh, truly brought to my knees over things we're reading in the newspaper. And, uh, and so, first of all, we've got to get this budget passed. It has increased salaries for law enforcement so we can recruit more. It's got $150 million in training and equipment uh, funds so that we can re better equip law enforcement. Youngkin says he wants to get people together to talk about other ways to address the gun violence we're seeing here in Hampton Roads and across Virginia. State lawmakers continue to work out the details to reach a deal on the budget. We'll keep you updated as those talks continue. In Virginia Beach, Brendan Ponton, News 3.